My name is Matthew Whiting. I am a lecturer in comparative politics at the University of Birmingham. And my main area of research is I look at why rebels moderate and uh, give up violence and take up exclusively peaceful methods and also why they sometimes remain radical and why they don't moderate under conditions in which you might expect them to. I'm particularly interested if I was thinking about case studies in Northern Ireland and Sinn Féin and the IRA in Northern Ireland and in the Kurds in Turkey. My book is called Sinn Féin and the IRA from revolution to moderation. And what it tries to do is trace how over a 30 year period in Northern Ireland, gradually the movement of Irish Republicanism decided to give up violence and enter exclusively the political arena. And where my book differs from existing literature and research on the topics is that I say this is a much more long term, gradual path dependent process. So the main causal drivers behind this was sustained contact by Sinn Féin and the IRA with strong institutions, particularly elections and particularly a framework of liberal democratic institutions. And over time, these gradually extracted concessions from republicanism, even if they didn't necessarily think they would when they first took part in elections, to lead us to see them get locked in this path of increasing moderation over time until they reached the peace process, which further locked them in in that path. Thank you.